adding an outline to your images can pop and make them stand out on your design. But how can you do that without using Photoshop? I shared the hack before how you can do that using the famous Canva app. And if this is your first time hearing Canva, Canva is a graphic design platform used to create social media graphic, presentations, posters, documents, and other visual contents. And just recently, they did an update. So now, I will show you the other way on how you can add outline to your images in less than one minute without even using Photoshop. Probably you are here because you are a content creator who want to pop up your thumbnails or you are a freelancer like me who are trying out some designs for your marketing purposes. With that, I want to know who are you. If you are a social media manager or a YouTuber or a content creator in general or a business owner, whatever, share it in the comment section below. and. Make sure to put also what type of content or tutorials you want me to make in the future. Whoever you are, I am definitely sure that this video will help you. In order for us to add an outline to our images, we have to make sure that the background of the image that we are going to put an outline with is properly removed. And by doing that, we have to go to remove that BG. And for example, um, uh, I don't have any picture in mind. And I, I'm using unsplash.com for me to get royalty-free images for any of my designs. So let's say uh, women. And I want this one. I'm going to right-click on this image and just copy it. And let's go now to remove that bg and for all of you who didn't know remove bg is the tool that canva is using on their platform and if you do not have a canva pro account you are probably not accessing this so that's why i am teaching you the hack to really go directly to remove that bg because i'm also using a free account let's try to remove the background of our chosen image as you can see we have two options here to upload the image and to just really paste the url of the image so i'll just control v right here it pastes right here as you can see now we have a properly and perfect background removed image just hover around the image and right click again and just copy image let us now go to canva app in my case it's the canva app because i've already downloaded the canva app and if you want to do the same i will put the link down the description box below where you can download the canva app for windows or for mac users let's create design for example instagram post now you have to paste the image here just Control v and there you go and click right here on your image and go to effects kindly choose the glow under the shadow category there but it's not the end of the tutorial because as you can see it's just a shadow basically so all you have to do is click this little settings right here click that and let's make the transparency into 100 the blur into number 2 and the size would be number 10 and it's just a personal preference for me to to be the outline like this but if you have other preferences other numbers that you want to make on your outline just do it and of course the color now we have a black outline but i want it to be like white outline and i want to make it just a little smoother and if you are satisfied with that you can just click the apply button okay let us now customize our design and if you happen to notice that i am not clicking in, in any of this to insert a text to 
taste something. It is because I am using Canva Shortcut Kiss. And if you want to know more about other Canva Shortcut Kiss that can make your designing even easier, I will link that video right. I will link that video right here so you can know other Canva Shortcut Kiss. And I so love Canva Shortcut Kiss because it saves me a lot of time. It saves me a lot of effort to really insert some shapes, some text. So if I were you, if you are really into designing, you have to know that Canva Shortcut Kiss. Yeah, there you go. We have now a proper outline on our image. So just remember, if you want a different style of outline to your image, just play along with those settings. It's just there. But make sure that it is final because we cannot edit it afterwards. For example, right here. Uh, for example, I want to make the outline thinner. I cannot undo that. I cannot do that because it will just add up to the existing outline. Let's see, for example, right there, can you see that? It will just add to your existing outline. That is why it is very important that you finalize your desired outline to your image. Creating a nice outline to our images is a plus point if this will make our design pop up and stand out even more. Personally, my thumbnails have a great impact on how I grew my YouTube channel. So whatever you are doing in life, this will 100% bring so much improvement on your future designs. Now, speaking of future designs, if you love this tutorial that I gave you on how you can add an outline to your images in less than a minute, even without using Photoshop, then make sure to hit that notification bell because the next video, I'm going to teach you how you can add different style of shadows on your image just in just one click. Now, if you want to learn more about other hacks and tutorials that I made in the past to make your designing so much easier, make sure you really check these two videos right here. I hope you guys have a great day, a great week, and a great life. And I will see you on the next one. Bye guys!